Welcome to another edition of Uplifting Interviews with Total Strangers. We've got Andres and Xavier. They did a full night of partying, because as they should, because they're young. And that's what you do when you're young. You party and have a great time. So what are you guys going to do this weekend? What's the, what's the plan? Right, the plan is going to Vegas in uh, six hours. Oh, really? Okay. It's a rave. Oh, a rave? Yeah, it's a big rave, so we might head over there. Might? No, it's like 90% sure we're going. Okay. Yeah. So you, I, I can't see your buddy. Hey. Say hi to the crowd. Say hi, bro. What's up, crowd? What's up? Hey, my bad. He's drunk. He's, he's gone. He's gone. Okay, you'll be the main star I'll of the, the show. Main, I'll be the main star. Don't trip. So you're going to go to Vegas for a rave? Yeah. And um, that starts what time? Is it it's late from, night? It's from 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. So 12 hours straight. 12 hour rave. And yeah. what will happen at that rave? Oh, man. It's crazy. Talk me, crazy. Th- talk me through one. Never been to one. I've been, uh, last EDC I went to in Vegas was 2013. Um, just know it was one for the books. Uh, there is a bunch of girls, half naked. Okay. Just on drugs. How, uh, how many people will attend this rave you're talking about? Or that one? It's, it's <laughs> I don't know, probably like 80,000. 80,000 people? 80,000. 80, 80,000 yeah, people? It's, it's a lot. It's, it's a big rave. It's, it's one of the biggest raves in the U.S. And they have it once a year? Yeah, once, once a year, once a year. They just literally moved it to May instead of June. Okay. So it's it's, it's pretty good because all the college students get out in May. Right. Yeah, so it should be good. And what's the name of it again? EDC. E- Las Vegas. DC. Yeah, EDC Las Vegas. EDC Las Vegas. And you dance, I guess? Oh, yeah, you, you just mostly, uh, you can go sober, you can go fucked up, you can drink. Take, most people take ecstasy. Oh. Uh, it's cool. That's cool. It's a cool experience. Twelve-hour concert. Oh yeah. And you must be toast afterwards. Oh, just on Sunday, the last day, you're just gone. You're just burnt. <laughs> so, but it's cool. It's, it's a good experience. Hey, you're young, you know. Yeah, yeah. Why not have fun? Yeah. So they have raves every month, someplace. Uh, they have. I think they have raves like every like three or four months. Uh huh. Around like L.A., Orange County, Knoll Center, San Bernardino. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. It's called Insomniac, but. Uh, do you Do you know Ultra? Oh yeah, oh that's that's one of, that's probably like as big as EDC. But that's not a rave though. No, that is a rave. Oh, that is a rave. Yeah, that's a rave. Okay. This is ridiculous. I set yeah, two lights. It's crazy. So where do I go from here? I go to Loyola. <laughs> wow. So that you're gonna have some fun today. That's exciting. And yeah, hopefully we go to Vegas. So you don't have your ticket yet? Uh, honestly, uh, it's kind of easy to sneak in. So, oh. No, but I mean, you're, you're gonna drive? Uh, that's the yeah. thing. We might drive. Yeah, yeah. yeah most likely we'll drive. Okay. Yeah. Should be cool though. Should be cool. Good experience. All my all my friends are over there. Okay. And what do you, what do you do for a living? Uh, I actually work for a company called the. Uh, I don't want to say it. You don't say the company. Yeah. It's just called a. It's a warehouse uh, job. Okay. We uh, work for Amazon, Google, Sony. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, in shipping, then I guess. Yes, yes, exactly. Uh, packaging shipping. Yeah. So, so Amazon sent me um, uh, some tennis balls. Okay. And luckily, my wife got it. They didn't even put it in a box. They put it in the box it comes with, yeah. so people can see what I've just been shipped. Yeah. They, they, and, and people are gonna take that for sure. That's the thing about Amazon. They don't, they don't really care. They just literally grab the product, put it in like whatever, and then just send it. So I'm happy to get my tennis balls. But anybody who plays tennis sees a whole can of tennis balls. You just come up, yeah. Just, just take it. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. That's the bad thing about Amazon. You gotta, they're really strict. If you don't follow the rules, they'll send it back. And it's just more money you lose and shit. So. Yeah, well, I, mean, I had some things stolen, obviously. And what's nice is sometimes they replace it, you know? I mean. Yeah. That's cool. That's cool. Cool job. Okay. Well, have fun at the rave. Right, what's your suggestion to people that go to raves? What's the preparation they should do? Oh, man. Uh, <laughs> just know your limit. Be safe. Be safe. Don't take Walk. pills. Drink water. Don't take pills. Uh-huh. Uh, just be people, uh, be around people you trust that take care of you. If, if you do, do pills. Okay. We might have got cut off there. What was the advice to go into a rave? One of the biggest raves, uh, one of the biggest tips to go to raves is uh, stay hydrated, eat, sleep. Well, try to sleep. <laughs> uh, beforehand, uh, not not during the rave. No, no, no. Beforehand, yeah. Get as much sleep as you can. Hydrate. That's the biggest thing. Hydrate. Eat. Uh, just be around friends you trust, people you, 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 uh, yeah, you just mostly trust, yeah, close friends, yeah. 
you have a good experience. It's, it's a lifetime of experience. That's for sure. <laughs> Just have a blast. That's it. <coughs> well, thank you so much for that. Have a great time. Stay safe. Thank you. Peace out. Peace out.